You know what I've always loved about Construct? It's art. I mean, just look at this immaculate detail. The rich saturation and the bright, vivid colors. You know, I've always wanted to make art like this, but unfortunately in Gary's Mod, you really can't. Well, today that changes. And today's video is sponsored by Opera GX. So if you guys have never heard of Opera GX, it's pretty much a browser made specifically for gamers. Now, of course, having it on desktop is great, but there's even a mobile version with GX Mobile. And of course, GX Mobile can be connected to the desktop version for seamless connectivity. Now, I think one of the features that a lot of people love about Opera GX, and personally one of my favorites, is the fact that you can customize the entire browser to whatever you see fit. You can customize the browser with themes, wallpapers, and colors of your choosing. And hey, you can even use animated wallpapers if that's your thing. Another feature that I absolutely love with Opera GX is the GX Corner. This is going to pretty much keep you up to date with all the free games across many different websites so you never miss a fantastic deal again. GX Corner is also going to give you a heads up on the newest releases and give you up to date news on anything gaming related. All of this and more is in this amazing browser, so guys, if you want to upgrade your browser game, definitely check out Opera GX down in the description. I'll also put a link down as a pinned comment, and I want to thank them for sponsoring this video. How's it going, guys? Welcome back to another mini mod showcase, and today we're going to be taking a look at the graffiti swept. So we've seen graffiti swept in the past, but they've been very basic. This one has a whole host of features. Just by pressing right click, we can choose our color, our brush, the size of the brush, and choose how often the spray comes out. All this just from one single mod. So let's go ahead and see what it looks like. Spraying, you can see we actually have the uh, emo texture on. We're gonna go to the regular colors though. So this is obviously the error logo, but for some reason it's <laughs> called emo texture in this mod. Oh, and by the way, stay till the end because it gets even more ridiculous. All right, but we're gonna show off the emerald now. So look at this. We get a cool little spray animation from the can, and it comes out absolutely perfect. Although if you do go pretty quick, you can kind of see it leaves like blotches, and that is precisely what this right here adjusts. So if we make it a bit bigger, look at this. I'm holding down left click the entire time, but it only sprays in certain instances. So maybe you want to make like a pattern or something. I mean, I, I really don't know why you'd want to use this, because you could just do the same thing by just tapping, and it's pretty much the same. But I digress, we can also of course change it up to a different color. Now I do wish that you could open up like a wheel menu so that you can change your colors from there and really get a fine tuned experience. But we're gonna go ahead and actually clean everything up. Oh, wait, that actually cleaned up the graffiti on the map. I thought that was like a baked in texture. I didn't know you could just get rid of it. All right, this is kind of wild. We're gonna go with Necros videos blue, small size, and look at this. Like I said, guys, you really can go as precise as you need. Now, I am tempted to draw a phallic object because that's something that everyone must do once you get anything that paints, but I'm gonna restrain myself for today's video so I don't get in trouble. By the way, when you clean up everything on the map, it does not bring the graffiti back. So you're gonna have to restart if that's something you wanna do. All right, so the first thing I wanted to do was, well, go over this. Be oh. Okay, so for instance, I want to see if I can trace this. Now we can see my graffiti skills in action. So it's not perfect because, well, you don't really get a lot of variances in size. For instance, I'm using small right now, but the thing is, I wish I could go just a little bit thinner. Oh, and we are actually running into a bit of a predicament here. There is a limit to how much you can spray. As you can see, the more I spray, the more we lose from where we were. So that's kind of unfortunate. Um, it does look cool though. Espe uh, yeah, I mean, wow, that looks awesome actually. Especially with the light on it, it kind of glows like neon. That is sick. All right, now I'm gonna show off what it looks like with the big spray size. So this is medium, this is big, and of course, this is small. So a nice variance in size there. I do wish there was more, but the fact that we even get any kind of difference is Honestly, kind of sick by itself, so I'm cool with that. We got kind of like a grayish blue here. By the way, guys, I don't know what this changes right here, the num slider. It says do nothing, so I, I assume it does nothing. 
All right, and here's my masterpiece. If this doesn't give away what's coming up, I had to stop because, well, while I was actually doing this, I was actually losing part of what I was doing. For instance, I was filling in the eye, and you can see we're losing the outline. <laughs> so again, that kind of sucks. I wish you could increase the limit. Maybe that's what this does. Maybe. All right, so now I think it's time to go into what we were waiting for, what you guys have probably been waiting for, and that's going to be the brushes. So we already saw the first one. Unfortunately, you cannot change these with the uh, the size, so you pretty much get what you get. And then we have Among Us, which is exactly <laughs> why I drew that. And then, of course, we have Big Floppa, because uh, why not? Wait, is he on a keyboard? And then last up, of course, we got Shrek, because uh, why not? But that's pretty much it, so guys, let me know what you think down below. Leave a like and subscribe if you want, as always. Links will be in the description. You can leave a suggestion down below, or of course in my Discord in the description. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and until next time, farewell.